Hey folks, Ash from Droning On Live here, and if you enjoy this kind of drone content, hit that subscribe button below. But hey, what a coincidence. Just yesterday, we put out a video about Sony's brand new up-and-coming drone release, Air Peak. And guess what they announced yesterday at CES, or very, very early this morning anyway? A drone. Or at least a drone project. The start of something. Now, what we see here on the left-hand side is on their YouTube channel. They've released a set of videos. So if you want to see those, go and have a look now. I'll put the link in the video description. But it's certainly not a consumer drone. And as we said in the last video, this is not initially going to be a drone for us. It looks like it's probably going to be a range of drone accessories and drone add-ons potentially, starting with what looks to be a Matrice, a DJI Matrice competitor. Now, DJI only recently released their 300 model and it's an incredible beast of a drone, able to lift a massive big red cinema camera and much, much more. This thing certainly seems to be kind of on par with that, although the initial video shows it lifting a, a basic SLR camera, although still a very impressive one, of course, because it's a Sony. Now, it does have some incredible features such as retractable undercarriage, although looking at the drone itself, it doesn't seem to have a vast array of sensors, but I think that's where the air peak element comes into play. I did at first, when I saw the mention of AI, think that this drone would be very much all about cameras surrounded by them and, you know, LiDAR and, and optical sensing but at the moment this is very much a baseline looking drone but i suspect like we said in the last video this is just the start now there are a load of videos out there i will be doing a comprehensive analysis of what we see released here in an upcoming video on the main channel but in the meantime have a look at sony's channel because they have a array of uh, an array of videos here showing the drone being unpacked set up and flying and what it can do it's very enterprise focused at the moment. Unfortunately, this does not look like a drone that you're going to want to be flying from your garden as a consumer, legally, of course. But I think that might be to come, although maybe Sony are cashing, on, cashing in on the fact that the enterprise drone sector is growing rapidly and that the consumer sector is already conquered by DJI. And probably Sony wants to avoid being the next GoPro drone failure. Now, before my video comes out, because I am busy and I do have a rather hectic life at the moment with work, before my video comes out, go and head over to my buddy uh, Jason Morris's channel. He's done a great video. He's one of the first to put a video out on this new release. Go and have a look at his comprehensive analysis of this new drone. Again, I'll put a link in the video description below. And be sure to subscribe to his channel because he does some great, great content as well. Really nice cinematographic cinematography it's too early for me anyway get excited because it's a new entrant to the drone market it's a new entrant to the, the enterprise commercial sector of drones and that's all healthy competition anyway comment below with your thoughts initially on this new product from sony give the video a thumbs up and hit subscribe if you're not already subscribed thanks for watching guys